Tonight, controversy after a Stanislaw County woman says she was kicked out of her gym for not wearing a mask. Now, she claims that she is medically exempt. But does a business have the right to refuse service in this case? CBS 13's Renee Santos is getting answers. I just got off the phone with the corporate office that oversees this in-shape gym here in Ceres. They are currently looking into this incident. We did some digging on this, and it turns out a business can refuse service. I fall under one of the exemptions, medical condition. Sarah Fontana is upset. She was kicked out of her in-shape gym in Ceres for not wearing a mask while working out. She has asthma and says wearing a mask while running isn't doable. Under the state's guidelines for face coverings, people must wear a face covering when inside any indoor public space. But people with a medical condition are exempt, including those who may have a hard time breathing because of a mask. But can a business refuse service to someone for not wearing a mask, even if they are exempt? We turn to attorney Mark Reichel. They can exclude someone and refuse service. He says a business can ask a customer if they are exempt. If there is an exemption, proof is necessary. If someone is asserting an exemption, absolutely. The burden is on them, obviously, to prove their exemption is legitimate and to back it up with medical paperwork. Sarah just wishes her situation was handled differently. They need to come up with some form of identification that maybe they put us in a specific spot so people know that there's an exemption being made for these uh, people working out. Well, InShape just got back to us saying in a statement they tried to make accommodations with Fontana. Yeah, and that statement reads in part, she chose to not take advantage of it, which then could place other members in the club at risk. Her membership has not been canceled. We are reaching out to her again and hoping we can find a safe and suitable solution.